time to look back on the past week on Blue Ridge 11 TV. Monday, girls soccer defending Section 3 champions Cacalico, unbeaten in their last four games, turned the offense on early against Garden Spot. Lehman's going to charge hard, looking to capitalize on a mistake here. Liv Smith trying to get the corner, did the touch let her down. Cross, header. That's got to be a goal, right? It trickles home. Chloe Martin scored twice. Juliana Gervais and Emma Strunk added goals for the Lady Eagles, who won 4 0 in this now Section 2 showdown. On Wednesday, we headed over to Lidditz for a new Section 1 matchup between Ephrata and Warwick in field hockey. Senior Breeze Acola did what she does best for the Warriors score a lot of goals. Craver, just really, really good wrist strength. I mean, the control that she's got over the ball. So dynamic, Socolo pops it up off the reverse. Did you catch that? Quick, quick action. She's now the all-time leading scorer for the Warwick Field Hockey Program, and so far this season has 19 goals. Oh, by the way, Warriors are 8-0 this season. Thursday, we headed over to War Memorial Field, Ephrata, now in Section 1 in girls soccer, facing off against Conestoga Valley. Fantastic game to watch on both sides as they seized momentum. Bella Pratt and Maya Curran put the Lady Mounts in front 2 to nothing at the half, but CV came back strong with two goals of their own in the second half before Avery Bender broke the tie. Throw in for effort to far side. Schumacher across the diamond. Bender's there! Goal! 10 seconds checking in for the starting unit. And Avery Bender puts that home. With her first goal of the season, Mounts win 3-2. That's Blue Ridge 11's weekly wrap-up. Stay tuned to social media for upcoming games and highlights. See you next week.